Hey everybody, welcome back for another Top 5 Wednesday. Today is another Top 5 Wednesday and it is gearing up for a very exciting moment in all of our reader lives and that is your top five favorite Hunger Games moments in honor of the Hunger Games movie which is coming out this Friday which I am super excited for. I probably won't get to see it until next Friday because I'll be super busy at my theater and Fridays are when I have a day off so I might get to see it opening night or I might have to wait just till next Friday. But either way I am super super excited for this movie and I've been talking about it a lot on this channel. So in honor of that final movie release Top 5 Wednesday today is your top 5 favorite Hunger Games moments in either book or movie setting. As always, Top 5 Wednesday was created by Lainey over on Ginger Reads Lainey. I will link her channel as well as the Goodreads group in the description below, so you can check those out. A lot of my top 5 favorite moments are actually equal, like the movie captured my favorite book moments and the books highlighted my favorite movie moments, so they're kind of the same from book to movie. My number five pick comes from Mockingjay and that was The Hanging Tree. I really enjoyed how they did it in the movie more than the book. I loved Jennifer Lawrence's singing voice and it was a really well done part in the movie and it was probably one of my favorite parts in Mockingjay Part 1 was The Hanging Tree and how Jennifer Lawrence betrayed that really emotional scene of being back in District 12. Number four also comes from Mockingjay and Mockingjay Part 1, and that is her If We Burn, You Burn With Us speech. So when she was in District 8 and President Snow bombs the hospital, Katniss goes on this really great speech on how if you think for one minute the Capitol will treat us fair, you're kidding yourselves kind of deal. And I loved how it was done in the movie and how that kind of launches to the rebels using that if we burn, you burn with us phrase in all of their promos or their propos and then the rebels themselves using that as kind of a war cry throughout the district. So I really enjoyed that and how it was portrayed in the movie. Number three, my favorite part was actually from the movies and that was the chariot entrances in both Catching Fire and Hunger Games as well as the costumes themselves in general in Catching Fire and Hunger Games. I loved the first chariot dress how it was very just open flames and then the second chariot dress they were a glowing burning ember and I loved the way they did that in the movie. I loved how it looked. Jennifer Lawrence it was just absolutely gorgeous and I just absolutely loved the costuming and her wedding dress turning into a mockingjay and her flaming red dress. Just the costumes were so elaborately done that as you're reading the book now you pictured those costumes. I loved how they took what you would imagine in the book and brought that to life in the movie and it was so well done. I loved it. Number two comes from The Hunger Games as this is my favorite book in the trilogy and number two was a really it wasn't like my favorite moment it was like a super sad moment that actually made me cry and that was Rue's death. I was very sad when Rue died. I loved her and Katniss's relationship. I loved their little alliance they had and how Katniss protected her because she reminded her of Prim so much and I was just so, so sad and heartbroken when she died, but how she arranged the flowers around Rue and sang Rue the lullaby, and then of course when she did everyone's favorite salute to the cameras, and so Rue's death was horribly sad and really beautiful at the same time, yet became a pivotal part and something Katniss excelled at was just being unscripted and everybody picked up on that with an event like Rue's death. And number one, of course, also comes from The Hunger Games, and it was so well done in the movie. Jennifer Lawrence just broke my heart in the scene, and just every time I even think about it or read about it in the book, I get emotional. And that was, of course, the moment she volunteered for Prim, and it was so well done in the movie. It was one of my favorite parts in The Hunger Games book, not because it's great that Prim got picked and that Catalyst is now in The Hunger Games, but because it was such an emotional part that made you connect with these characters, that made you feel 
for these characters and that just your heart went out the prim your heart went out the Katniss and that was like your big connection part of the book was the whole I volunteers tribute and Jennifer Lawrence in the movie did it so brilliant it is one of my favorite scenes in the Hunger Games it is just so iconic now to the Hunger Games fandom. So those are my top five favorite moments from the Hunger Games movies and books. I'm not too sure if I'll do a Hunger Games reaction video as I kind of have most of my videos planned for the month. I might do a quick vlog intro of what I thought about Mockingjay Part 2. And as I said before, it is coming out this week, you guys. It's out this Friday. I'm super excited. I will let you know what I thought. You'll probably hear about it on Twitter as well. So. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and may the odds be ever in your favor.